Uh, we got C.J. Geddes, Frank Jackson, and uh, Craig Ponder. Questions? Freddy, what happened out there? <laughs> Man, we just we played well tonight. Um, we shared the ball. We had 26 assists. I mean, I just played off my teammates and uh, I'm still. When did you know it was going to be a good night for you? Um, when the first three went in, I felt pretty good after that. How big was this for you personally, just coming off of a tough night at Davidson? Uh, it was big, um, just to get the feel back for, uh, get the winning taste back in the mouth. Um, we worked hard uh, leading up to this game, and uh, it's good to see it pay off. Craig, last time you guys played a non-Division One team in here a couple weeks ago, you let them hang around. What was the key to making sure that didn't happen tonight? Um, we just wanted to execute defensively, do all the right things, do all the little things like uh, boxing out. Uh, finding your man and being in the right help position and everything, you know, we really stressed that in our walkthroughs and prepared well. And we executed the game plan that the coaches prepared for us. CJ, that was a long haul down the floor for a big dunk. Uh, so, you know, I know we've talked about the way that you've lost and how hard you've worked to get to that, but to see it actually happen in a game, how nice was that for you and your mindset about it? Uh, it felt great. There was a lot of confidence. Uh, like Freddie said, you know, just Especially that play, played off my teammates. Jordan was running down the sideline, pitching back for an open dunk, and a guy just happened to come over and try to help. Um, the weight loss just you know helped tremendously. Long minutes, plays like that. This is for any of you guys. I know it's early, and I know there's a lot of things that are coming in, but there's a lot more smiling, a lot more you know just the, the attitude seems to be different, even the way you guys talk. How you know. How easy is it to slowly put the past behind and look forward to what's what's coming ahead? Uh, the first day that Keats came here with us, he said the past is the past and uh, nothing else matters. But now, you know, we, he, as soon as he came here, he said he doesn't care about anything that happened previously, and that we were just going to work on building a new program and uh, starting the right way. Right, you guys waited a long time to play a home game, I guess. What, what does it mean to you to come out and put a, together a good performance for them? Uh, uh, it meant a lot. It meant a lot to see uh, a lot of familiar faces from last year. Um, the crowd energy was, was a, played a big part, um, helped us out a lot. Uh, it was good to see this, all the students there. Uh, I think that was the most students I've seen in a while in trials. Um, we just fed off that energy. Seemed like you guys were pretty pumped seeing Nick Powell drop a couple threes there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we all we all love Nick. Well, we all love each other. So um, when one our teammates do well, you know, we all love that. Craig, you guys have obviously a ten day break. I guess feel good to get some confidence into that. Uh, little break here. Yeah, definitely. Um, like Freddie said earlier, getting that win and taste back in your mouth. Uh, that's huge. You're going into our next game, and um, we're just gonna work hard. Next ten days, these next few days, and make sure that we're prepared. Any other questions? Okay, thank you, gentlemen.